It's time to step on board Royal Caribbean International's Oasis of the Seas, one of the largest cruise ships in the world. This ship's revolutionary design includes Central Park, the first living park at sea, and the Aqua Theater, the first aquatic amphitheater at sea, and 15 decks of vacation bliss. And we are gonna show you everything. Well, as much as we can in a few minutes. We better hurry. Taking your next dream vacation on board Oasis of the Seas will be a vacation you and yours will be talking about for years. Families, couples, and friends will all feel welcome here. The Oasis of the Seas has activities and amenities to suit any first time or experienced cruiser. Some have described this ship as a city at sea, which in my opinion is pretty accurate. But what's a city without neighborhoods? On board Oasis of the Seas, you'll find seven distinct neighborhoods that will make you feel right at home. Right behind me, that's the promenade. You'll also find the entertainment district, the boardwalk, and my favorite, Central Park. Did you know this is the first ever living park at sea? With over 1,200 varieties of plants and plenty of trees, this is the best place for a romantic stroll, day or night. Exploring Oasis of the Seas is one of the true joys of sailing with her. This ship can easily accommodate over 6,000 passengers and over 2,000 crew members. So how does this ship bring value to your vacation dollar? Simple, variety and choice. Let's take staterooms for instance. Bringing the kids and the grandparents? No problem. Oasis of the Seas has a seemingly endless selection of room types and configurations. The loft suites are some of the most innovative staterooms at sea. And staying in a suite is an experience in and of itself. Suite guests enjoy private concierge and other special perks. Family suites are available for those needing a little extra space or bedroom. Naturally, you'll also find inside and ocean view cabins, balcony cabins, and cabins overlooking Central Park, the boardwalk, or the promenade. If you're looking to make the most of your time on Oasis of the Seas, then I suggest you get up pretty early because there are more activities on board than there are hours in the day. For a little adventure, head to the pool deck and sports zone. Or you can climb there two rock climbing walls, over 40 feet high, shoot some hoops, putt around on the miniature golf course, take a dip in one of their five swimming pools, even go ice skating. And if that's not active enough, then you may want to try zip lining. Who says surfing's just for the beach? Here you can catch a continuous wave on one of the two Flowrider surf simulators. Expert instruction, no sharks, and a healthy dose of humiliation. And fun. Wow. Unfortunately, we don't have time to discuss each of the 24 unique dining venues, but I assure you, you will not go hungry. Here are a couple suggestions. Enjoy a few meals in the Opus dining room. You'll love the traditional onboard dining experience. And of course, stop by the Windjammer Cafe for a modern day take on selecting your meal at your pace. You know what would make this donut better? Ice cream. Oasis of the Seas is also home to an amazing variety of mouth-watering premium restaurants. Chops Grill, Giovanni's Table, Johnny Rockets, and Tapas at Vintages are a few of my favorites. For the ultimate in dining on board, you have to have dinner here at 150 Central Park because James Beard award-winning chef Michael Schwartz has something special planned every cruise. And here's a tip. These restaurants are in high demand, so make your reservation before you set sail or as soon as you can once you're on board. Did you know Oasis of the Seas is one of the most kid-friendly ships at sea? It's true. Nurseries and babysitting services are available as well as youth and teen programs and all are offered with age-appropriate activities, contests, and fun. And while the kids are at play, you might want to do a little shopping. Central Park and the Royal Promenade is where you'll find a wide variety of name brand, duty-free shops, including my favorite, Coach. Everything from jewelry, perfumes, and apparel can be purchased in the ship's numerous boutiques. Now I should warn you that that shopping may help or hinder the relaxation process, so I recommend taking a break every now and again to right the old ship, if you know what I mean. Thank you. Of course, senor. Hmm. Did you know all your onboard entertainment is absolutely free? Yeah, so you could take in a full-length hit Broadway show or an ice dancing show, laugh a little in the comedy club, get your Fleetwood Mac on at the karaoke bar, 
And whatever you do, don't miss a show in the onboard aqua theater. In addition, the experts at Vitality Spa will introduce you to a whole new world of relaxation. The spa menu features a variety of treatments to rejuvenate, including metaspa services, massage, and facials. Deck 6 is also where you'll find the state-of-the-art fitness center and classes. You may not be out clubbing on the weekends back home, but when you're on your cruise, that fresh sea air will give you all the courage you need to dance the night away every night of the week. Suffice it to say, Oasis of the Seas has plenty of theme parties, nightclubs, and lounges to just unwind. So check your cruise compass and find the party that best suits you, but more importantly, just get out there and have fun. If you ask me, I think it's time to take your next dream vacation to the next level by sailing on board one of the most magnificent ships in modern day history. We're on board Royal Caribbean International's Oasis of the Seas. I'm Eric Hastings, thanks for watching. Start planning your dream vacation today by contacting your vacation specialist.